Um, so have you ever played Cluedo? I have. Many, you have? Many years ago. Excellent. All right, that's good, because you're going to need that expertise now. Okay. We're going to play a version. I found this game that's a, a card version of Cluedo called Detection. I think it might be a bit of a copy, truth uh, be told. Okay. Um, like this. And what happens on here is you have the names and the weapons together so they can give you less cards. Okay. And I've noticed each one, um, they're in pairs, they're like in couples. So you have Mr. and Mrs. Stone, Mr. and Mrs. Brown, Mr. and Mrs. Jones, I think, is there. Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Mr. and Mrs. Wood. <coughs> so, okay. what we're gonna do is we're gonna have a sort of murder mystery in which you are the star witness. Okay? Ooh, That's responsibility. Good, yeah, exactly. The responsibility as well. <laughs> um, so what I'm going to have you do, we've got 10 cards. So I want you to think of a number between 1 and 10. And we're going to use that to represent the time that you see the murder happen. Right, okay. okay. So imagine that these 10 people are in a house. One of them that you're about to see is conspiring to kill his significant other or her significant other. Oh, All right. Okay. So what will happen is, yeah, you're, we'll use your number as the time. Okay. I'll show you the cards one at a time. And the person at your number, that's who you need to remember. That's right. the murderer. Okay. Okay. So that's person number one. That's person number two. That's person number three. That's four. I'll look away as well. Five, six, seven, eight, nine and 10. Okay, so okay. now you know who the murderer is. I do. And you're the only person in the world who knows for sure. Okay. And you also know who the victim is because you know they're going to kill their partner True. as well. So you're way ahead of the game. Okay. Um, and Can I warn them? I want to warn you know, them. No, it's too late for them. The fate, it's all over for oh, them now. Okay. Uh, but uh, the next thing we need to work out is the weapon. And we're going to do that a bit differently. Now, uh, say for example, your number that you were thinking of was uh, three, for example. Here's what I'd have you do. I'd have you take the cards and move three cards, one at a time, from the top to the bottom. So you go one, two, three. Okay? okay. But with your number, obviously, rather okay. than mine. So uh, we'll give them a little mix. I'll give you those, and then I will turn away on this rotatey stool made for the job. <laughs> um, and then I want you to move cards one at a time from the top to the bottom. Uh, the same number as the number that you're thinking of. And then just let me know when you've done that. Okay, Excellent. done. Then what I want you to do is to just look at the bottom card of the whole packet and remember that weapon, because that's the weapon that you've seen at the same time, and then set the whole packet down on the table. Okay. You done? Yes. Excellent stuff. So now you know everything about the murder, the victim and the weapon. Now, have you ever heard of psychic detectives? Uh, yes, I have. Is it actually a thing? Apparently, yeah. um, the Yorkshire Ripper was caught by a psychic who, over a map, went, it's him and he's there. No. Yeah. Oh, so, I didn't know that. I don't know if that means he was rubbish or if the police were not very good either. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> However you look at it, something went wrong there. Um, but I'm going to try and be uh, a psychic detective and pick up the information okay. of this murder. Okay. So these are going to be my clues. Uh, this one, no, I don't feel... Oh. Yeah, I feel something here. This one is the victim, I think. Uh, yeah, so I got, got very dead vibes from Ooh. there. Uh, <laughs> let's have a look here, nothing. Oh, bad vibes from that one. That's the murderer, I reckon. No. And the weapon now, let's go for the weapon. This doesn't always work, but I think it's here. And with a little bit of luck, we've solved the murder of Mrs. Jones. <gasps> murdered by Mr. Jones in a particularly gory fashion with the scissors. Was that right? It was absolutely right. We have solved a murder. <laughs>